Should he be comparing himself to Michael Jordan? No, because I think it's beneath him. I don't want to hear Tom Hanks. Beneath him? Yeah, I mean, LeBron James is so global, is so big, is maybe the second best basketball player today in the history of the world. It's beneath Tom Hanks, our president, for people that great to compare themselves. But in sports, comparing is a cottage industry. You don't hear Brady comparing himself to Peyton. Tom's above that. Well, those guys are peers and they're competitors. Michael Jordan is the greatest of all time in most people's mind. He's well past his playing career in prime. Why isn't he? I think it's a healthy thing. It's Look, and again, I'm not putting myself on the same level, but my idol was always Mike Royko and Ralph Wiley, and I compare myself to them all the time and say I'm chasing them all the time. I think it's healthy to have that target. I think it's a sign of respect for Jordan, and I think it's, I think it's I, good. I, I, I think, think it's the, motivation. I think the target's fine. I just th think some things are better left unsaid. For all we know, Tom Hanks is chasing Marlon Brando. Like, I, there's a lot of things in life that I'm motivated by, inspired by, and upset by. I don't make them public. And I think LeBron has reached a point that um, as great as Michael was, and he is still so Im important domestically, I think LeBron sees himself as a global figure. That's why he's embraced Hollywood. Um, he's embraced social activism. And I think it's beneath him. All right, well, listen, and I say this respectfully towards both of you, but if people were constantly talking about Jim Rome and Colin Cowherd and Jim yeah. Rome and what he did in the 90s. And every time you opened up a newspaper <laughs> or turned on your computer, everybody was comparing you to Jim Rome. What, it kind of forces LeBron to address it. We force LeBron to talk about the Michael Jordan thing because we've jammed it down his throat, yes? We have, but if people did that, and they don't, but if they did, I would say that's for somebody else. Somebody asked Vin Scully once about comparisons, and he said, you know, it's a cottage industry. I I'm not going to get into that stuff. Just because you're invited to a party, you don't have to go. Just because you're invited to you a... You don't have to dance. Just because you're you invited don't, to a party. You don't have to go, and I think LeBron's bigger than that.